G'day folks, welcome to our much loved caravan, now up for grabs. Uh, this has been a fabulous family caravan for us. It's a 24 foot um, Island Star Oasis family bunk van and we've also got a tinny boat package to be included in the sale of this caravan as well. It's a great opportunity if you just want to hit the um, road locally and get away for weekends as a family, school holidays, or maybe you want to embark on that mighty trip around Australia. Full specs are listed down below. If you've got any queries, I know this van like the back of my hand, reach out, I'll answer any questions. We're going to take you on a bit of a tour to show you the outside to the inside. We'll show you the tinny boat loader to get the tinny up onto your um, four wheel drive roof as well. And then we'll show you the tinny as well. That's included in this complete package that you can just hook on and get away. Everything's included, all accessories. Just get it on your hitch and you're on the road. Anyway, let's jump out the front here. So the first thing I'm gonna point out is we've got a dot .35 hitch as well. Uh, we've got some navigator gear that's included in the sale. So you can see here, we've got a hitch cover. You've got two nine kilo gas bottles. Um, we've put on a customized box there that's got obviously doors on both sides. There is a partition down the middle there. Both sides has fridge slides. So if you wanna put a jerry in one side, uh, sorry, generator in one side, you can do that. We had our Weber Q on the other side there. As you can see, we've got a bike rack here as well, which can get up to three bikes in total. Um, I'll put some mounts here. So for the petrol can for the tinny you can carry that here and maybe a couple of swags uh, we've got some just working lights as well on top of the box um, as you can see i'll just point out here mel there's a mount here so um, connected to this van or inclusive in the sale is a wide band antenna so 3g 4g 5g wide band antenna that comes with a eight meter extendable telescopic mask as well um, basically you have the wide band antenna uh, attached to the top. We've got plenty of content of travels we've done and products we've added to this van over time, so we'll add that down below. But essentially, you'll see inside we've got a Telstra 5G Nighthawk modem wireless or Wi Fi router, router, I should say, that's included. So if you need to get off grid but you still need to be online a little bit to do some work or connect with family, um, you're going to have full scope to do that. I'll point out um, you've got Dometic DRS we've installed as well, dust reduction system. In total, plenty of storage throughout the whole van. Underneath the van, you've got a total of three 90 litre fresh water tanks, giving you a total of 270 litres of fresh water capacity and a 90 litre uh, grey water tank at the back. You've got two external speakers as well and two internal speakers. You can isolate them with the access head unit that's inside. So if you want music playing through all four, you can do that. Or if you just want on the outside or the inside, you can isolate. Um, 17 foot Dometic awning, which comes with full skirting, full enclosed annex, um, will be included in the sale too. Um, I'll just point out, we've got full annex matting for the outside included, and we've got three tidy turf floor mats, one that goes underneath this step, one on the step obviously, and one in your footwell inside here. Pretty much, guys, this is gonna be the complete, pro um, the complete product you need to purchase. You don't need to worry about sullage hose, you don't need to worry about uh, power cables, you don't need to worry about awning straps or pegs or everything, anything like that. Everything's included here so that you can literally just hook on, get on the road and get away. I'll just point out on the roof, solar, we've got three uh, 300 watt panels. So giving you a total of 900 watts in solar. They are wired in series, which will give you maximum voltage input for recovery, uh, quick recovery of your batteries, obviously. They generally average around 22 to 24 volts per panel on a nice clear day today. Coming inside, one of the things Mel and I absolutely love about this van, it's a unique floor plan. We didn't see this too often. It's not very common that you can get this type of van. It sort of offers three separate private areas to the van itself. So coming into the middle, you'll see here, we've got the lounge dining area as well. Nice, earthy, neutral tones that don't really date too much. Um, obviously you've got gas cooking, griller, oven, 187, litre Thurford fridge freezer, microwave, access head unit, as I said. You've got the Air Command IBIS 3 uh, air conditioning unit, which does reverse cycle heating and cooling. It's also got an evaporative option as well, and then it's got a fan as well. So this is what we call the central hub, internal entertaining space of the van, but you have constant tinas, so you, doors. So you've got a constant tina door here, through to the master bedroom, as I mentioned, uh, which you can privately shut that door off, um, one of the first things we did, guys, is we upgraded the mattress straight away. So in this, we've got a high quality, um, good grade pillow top mattress for 
mum and dad to sleep easy at night. Um, plenty of cabinetry, pl plenty of storage. We've put some shelving in here as well. We've added some extra USB chargers throughout the van because as a family with many electronics, laptops, phones, we've got plenty of charging points. Just over here, Mel, you've got, um, this is the Nighthawk 5G Wi-Fi modem router. So all you simply do is put your Telstra SIM card, data SIM card in there and it activates everything wirelessly within the caravan. And then obviously you've got the eight meter mast with the wideband antenna, which is kind of line of sight. Um, you've also got a Sonos sound bar there as well. Um, excuse this, this will all be tidied up very shortly. Um, you've got Bluetooth here as well to connect up additional Bluetooth products to the van. And we've got um, a Sat King box and a Sat King TV here. I'll just point out there is an additional Sat King box um, and another TV, uh, a 22 inch, I think it is, LED, 32. The wife, the camera lady is telling me 32 inch, um, which goes outside. So you can watch TV inside and you can also connect up the Sat King box, which is a secondary one to the TV outside. The satellite dish itself comes with dual LMB. So you can run it to the inside TV, which is connected to the um, antenna on the outside and you can run it to the Sat King box outside. So whatever you're watching inside, you can watch outside as well. Enjoy footy season, cricket season. Um, we've got four Sirocco fans throughout. So we've got two here in the master bedroom and you'll see in a moment, there's two in the bunk bed area as well. Um, plenty of storage under the bed here, corner cabinetry. Yeah, there's storage galore. I mean, we traveled full time in this van and we lived out of here for nearly 11 months and no problems with storage. So, um, oh, 12 volt, very important. So under here, all the 12 volt. So pretty much we've overhauled everything to do with the 12 volt on this van. So you've got new wiring, new fuses, new isolators, breakers, you name it, it's all new. We've gone good quality products. So in total, you've got 400 lithium amp hours in batteries, two 200 DCS lithium batteries in total under there, um, which can be you can you basically have a DCS app um, so you can see what the performance of the batteries is doing at any given time. Then we've gone Victron products throughout the rest of the 12 volt setup. So you've got a Victron um, MPPT 50 amp solar regulator and we've got a 30 amp Victron battery charger. Again, everything wirelessly, seamlessly, Bluetooth T app so you can see how many watts or volts your solar is putting in, what your battery is charging at or sitting out, um, everything you can see via a Bluetooth app. We've got a microwave, access head unit, jumping through here, another Constantina door. Um, here's through to the kids area. So we've got dual bunk beds, two Sirocco fans for them as well, DVD head units obviously, and again, another Constantina door. So if the kids are in here sleeping away, they've got direct access to the toilet if needed, or if mum and dad sitting inside watching a bit of TV, you can shut this Constantina door obviously. There's that Dometic DRS unit as well. Um, one of the other things that the wife absolutely loved about this van is that it has a separate toilet, wash area, and shower. We do have two Thurtford cassettes that come with the toilet as well. Um, you're gonna have to go in there to show the shower, love. Because if I open the door, I'll shut you out. <laughs> so separate shower as well. The hot water service is dual, so you can have it electric and um, you can have it electric or you can have it gas or you can have it both. Electric and gas, obviously it's gonna heat, heat up quicker. I will point out there is a Victron 3000 watt inverter under there as well. So all good quality gear, Victron gear, DCS batteries, no problems running the air conditioner, no problems powering up your microphone, um, microwave. I mean, we've even had the air fryer and the microwave going at once. The fridge itself, as I said, Thurford 187 litre fridge. It is a three stage fridge as well. But that's pretty much it for the van itself. Again, if you've got any questions, full specs are down below. Reach out to me, all my contact information's there. Um, in here is plenty of storage. As I said, um, we've got the sullage hose at the back here that's included. This is the little tinny trailer. So this is what you use to slide off to get the tinny onto when you're in destinations where you don't need a big trailer, obviously. Um, you've got a jerry can holder over there. We do have a diesel heater that's also installed on the van. You've got the navigator rear wheel carry bag there that carries all your wheel chocks, your levelers, you name it. On the other side there, 
which we can't get into. It's a little bit tight, but I'll just point out that's where all your power cables, all your water hosing, everything's nicely packed in there, ready to go. Water connectors, you name it, in navigator gear and bags as well. Um, reverse camera as well will be included. All right. Now, jumping in over here. This is the side loader on the, on, uh, the Land Cruiser. So it's a boat hoist uh, side loader. Again, full specs are down below. It can hold in total 130 kilos on top. You'll see in a moment, but we get the tinny up onto the roof with the engine inside mounted to the gunwale of the tinny itself. I've got a little aluminium um, trolley that comes with the tinny and the sale of this complete package. And that little trolley basically mounts to the gunwales of the tinny so that you can slide the tinny up onto the roof with the engine inside, everything on top, tinny, boat, boat engine, you name it. Uh, it comes with a 3,000 pound or around about a 1,300 kilo electric winch that is Bluetooth wireless remote operated and it comes uh, and it's spooled with dyna rope as well. So that's included. I haven't got it down just in case if you're interested in this and you might want to see how you undo it. That's why I'm showing this complete package because you can come here, have a look, and I'll show you and step you through everything that you need to know. Let's jump inside. Timmy, our much beloved Tinny, has got us many, many fish, which has been most adventurous. Um, it's a Quintrex Dart 3.75 aluminium Tinny. Um, it is on a Brooker trailer as well. So again, this trailer is included in the total package. Now, why do I have two trailers? One's always permanently on the van for when we get away. One's for local use, obviously. So if I get over to York Peninsula, Air Peninsula, or even fishing locally, it sits on here. Obviously, when we're traveling with the van, it goes on top of the car, and we've got that trailer on the back of the van ready to go. Um, you've got here the Water Snake Geo Spot 12 volt electric motor included. Um, 65 pounds of thrust, and it's a 54 inch electric motor. Three stages to it, obviously the main one being um, anchor lock, so you don't need an anchor with this tinny. Um, 100 amp hour lithium battery comes with the tinny as well, all Anderson plugged, this tinny fully rewired by us. Um, this battery, pretty much when I go out, can go three days, full days, maybe even four, I think I've fished hard, without even needing to charge that 100 hour lithium hour battery using this without no anchor. Um, we've got Railblazer rod holders throughout, cup holder, Railblazer um, cup holders, Railblazer bait board, the mighty sounder, the most important, um, the most important thing any fisherman will need. So this is a high-end quality sounder, Lawrence Elite TI, I always get this wrong, T9, TI? 9TI2, so Lawrence Elite 9TI2 sounder. This has got phenomenal quality. Um, I've decked it out, obviously carpeted the flooring there as well, so it's soft underfoot, ocean south cushion seat. You've got the Yamaha 15 horsepower long leg engine on the back there. It comes with a nine degree prop. I do have a spare 11 degree prop as well. And on the back there, which probably helps to what I was just saying before, why that battery can go a good three, four days without needing to charge with the electric water snake is because you've got a little five watt solar panel here that's linked back into the battery. So when you're out, it will charge the battery from solar energy. Um, the Brooker trailer comes with registration, LED lighting, obviously. And all accessories are included in the caravan, as I said, also the boat. So we've got three life jackets in here. You've got flares ready to go, bailing bucket, bailing rope, sullage hose, 10 amp, 15 amp cables in the caravan. As I said, it's a complete package. There's nothing you need to do here, folks. Don't shop around, get the van, and then try and piece together the package as I did over nearly two years to build all this up when you can have it all here now. So I think that pretty much wraps it up. Have I missed anything, love? No, I don't think so. No, gas bayonet outside here. Um, yeah, as I said. Yeah, this is a drop down table. As I said, this is where we put the outdoor TV, Sat King box. Um, so we can watch satellite TV out here wherever we are around Australia or wherever you might be around Australia. You can get and watch TV inside or outside. So mixed emotions, hope you've enjoyed the tour. It's done what we've needed it to do. Ideally, 
it would make sense to sell the tinny and the caravan as a complete package with that little trailer on the back. Um, so if you're after the complete package, why wait? You can have it all here now. Um, the van owes us nothing. It's done what we needed to do as part of our adventures. It's now onwards to the next adventure to us for us. So over to you. If you've got any questions, queries, or you want to come in and spec, just reach out to me anytime. Thanks for joining us on this tour, folks. Bye.